What's up, you guys? We live. Look at that. I wasn't even out looking for a dually. It's just this one was on the lot. And I was like, huh. And he said, oh, that one's a dually. I'm like, I'll take it right off the bat. So we'll do a quick little walk around here. So you guys know that my previous shot pony is right there. That's my 98 Astro. She's still great and it's still gonna be a, a great little trash runner or whatever I wanna do with it. Probably put some bead in that thing. Probably do something pretty wild with it if ever I get a chance. But right now, this is the, hey Brando. Hey, you feel like doing something for me after I do this walk, walk around? Time to do our first mods here in a second. You guys already know the first mods I'm gonna do to this thing, right? So I, I just got this thing yesterday. So no, no, no bump in it yet. Uh, I missed your name, sorry. Yeah, no bump in it yet. What up, Brandon, what up, what up? It's kind of bright out here and my glasses are uh, transitions. So it's a little bit uh, hard for me to read your comments right now. But we'll show you guys this cool little thing right here. Got it yesterday. Brand new, well, I mean, yeah, it is brand new. It's not a 2020 though, it's a, it's a 2019. No miles on it for only owner. Okay, so let's show you guys the back. I'll show you guys the front too, and of course, here in a second. And um, check it out. We're gonna load this thing up and I'm gonna drive it to, uh, to Reno to go drop off all of our packages to Sky High. So what I'm gonna do is after I do the little walk around, I may go live throughout through the trip and just say, hey, what's up? You know, let you guys know how it feels on the highway full of, you know, full of stuff. And um, might even take a little stop over there at Gately's if he's ready, I'm gonna bring some boxes up there for him too. Um, and then when I get to Sky High, we'll do a little live walk around over there. So today's gonna be kind of like a lot of live stuff going on on YouTube. So set your notifications and um, yeah, it'll be kind of fun. Okay, so let's look at the back of this. So it's a Sprinter. Mercedes, hey, is it bad that I'm old school and the first thing I thought of was, uh, I'm gonna rip that hood ornament off and put it on my chain. In my own fucking car, I'm gonna take the ornament off and put it on my chain and then get hella pissed when I come out there in the morning and my ornament's gone. So we got the 3500 XD. What up, Tim Taylor? Look at this fucking cavern, you guys. Okay, also one thing that I wanna let you guys know about this thing is, uh, I, I didn't even know this because I was shopping around for sprinters that had windows in them because I'm not gonna pack this full of garbage. So I want windows. I wanna actually like make, I'm gonna sound in this. I'm gonna put some seats in here that can be removed, that can be removed when I want all the space. Maybe like two rows and then I'll hit, still have tons of space. But apparently there's companies out there that put these windows in for you. I did not know that. So these cutouts that are already right here they're like tailor-made, I guess, ready to go if you want to put your own windows in. Or not your own, but they make them for it. So I'm going to have the windows all put in. I didn't really want white. I wanted the black one. But this was my options right now. And the dually was what set me off. I had to take the dually. So this thing can be wrapped. I'll wrap it. I'm not worried about the color. And white is nice and cool in the summer anyways. I don't know about rims, man, but maybe, I mean, I don't know. They're not bad stock, but maybe some, what do you, what do you put on dualies? I don't even know. I've never, it's my first dually, my first Benz and my first dually. But I mean, what do you do? Put some Alcoas on here or something? I don't know. They, they seem fine for stock. I'm not trying to like, I mean, I want it to be a fucking war pony. I'm not really worried about like fashion. So let me go in here and I'll, let me open up the side door. Oh, I'm gonna put some bead in it. It's gonna have, it's not gonna be a base machine, but I will put, there is gonna be some, I mean, hey, don't think I'm not gonna reserve this for me. Fuck that, this is gonna be reserved for me. And uh, I sorta wanna put a platform down that's raised up about, maybe even as high as these uh, fender wells, Brando. If I put a platform this high, then I can slide materials underneath it and still use it to slide stuff under and put stuff on top but then I can have, maybe I don't want to go as high as the fender wells, maybe lower than that. Just enough to fit like a bunch of sheets if I need to. But I want to be able to put seats that I can remove. Of course, sound in it, put the, put the uh, windows in it. 
keep it functional. But this thing right here, you guys, this has to go. That's the first thing we're going to do. So while I am showing you the cab, Brando, do you want to do me a favor? What's that? Will you, um, let me see, go grab some torques. Let's take this thing out of here, man. This thing's annoying. Yep. If you don't mind, please. You're on the clock, right? Yeah, cool. All right, cool. We're out. All right. So Brando's on the clock. He does what I say. <laughs> so here's the cab. Yep. Yep. Uh, horn, 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 honorful. That's what I was thinking, man. If I raise it up a little bit, I can still get all the shit that I want to carry around, like flat stock underneath it and still have room to do other stuff that I want to do. And if I do it right, I can take that platform out too. It doesn't have to be permanent. So, all right. Oh shit, you know what? I let Brandon drive this thing last. It's all the way up no, to the front. Yes, it is, dude. No, it is not. Dude, I do not drive. That's another reason I'm taking this out because you can't get your gangster lean on it at all. How do you do this? I oh, like this on here, huh? Yeah, I try to drive, man. I'm driving straight up and down. I don't really like that very much. How do you move this fucking seat? Oh, there we go. Okay. Hey, put it this way, you guys. You guys are, I don't know if you guys are like me. I'm not a very tall person, but I still drive like someone who's six foot four. I'm lean way back. I, I hit the gas pedal with my toenails and I'm good to go. So I don't like driving like way up by the steering wheel for safety purposes. So I'm going to do these ones behind them. I want to do the ones in the cab first. Okay. Well, after I show everybody this stuff, then you can move the seat back forward again. All right. So it's got a bare bones radio in it, but it's still. Is it even going to turn on? Oh, there we go. You guys know I don't give a fuck about this radio. It's going to have an iPad in it for fucking sure. I know this thing pops off. It looks like it does. So I'll have an iPad in here. Uh, all this stuff is cool. It's all digital and stuff. Let me see. So it's showing that all my, hey, it's got an indicator. It shows like, like all the doors are open right now. That's cool. Like specific door, instead of like a light that says that your doors are open, it's like every, it's showing each door that's open. It's all, uh, it's got a digital speedometer. I know uh, to you youngsters, that's nothing special, but to an old guy like me, that's still high tech. So yeah, when you're driving, all that shit shows up. Uh, Dazzy 84, it is a uh, turbo diesel. V6. So, all right. So, you know, this is going to come out. Look at this up here. Tell me, I, I could put, I could put a sick ass center channel in here or something. I mean, this is just begging. I can make this, I'd rather make it a sound quality mobile than a fucking walled base mobile, to be honest. Cause then I can have a work truck that sounds super good and be on the down low. I think I'm going to do all audio control in here, man. And then I'm going to make it removable so everybody that's listening right now isn't going to try to steal it. Yeah, it'll be removable with some SMD fucking terminal caps. I'll even remove the fucking amps so there ain't going to be nothing in here at night. But, uh, yeah, watch. I'll do it. I'll do it. Yep, a mid-bass monster. That David, David Dean, you got it, man. You got it. So, anyhow, there's all kinds of features. Hey, this is like a... It's even got a touchscreen fucking steering wheel thing so I can go through all the different menus. I don't know if it's going to let me right now, but yeah, this is all like the little stick. Oh, this fucking thing has, hey, Brando, dude, look at the, get up in there and tell me if there's something you didn't even notice. Hop in there. I'm going to show you. I didn't even use, I forgot to use them yesterday. This is, I know it's, oh, I already know, dude. Dude, do you see it? Do paddle you see, shifters? It's got paddle shifters. What? <laughs> I forgot. I saw them at the dealer. I said, oh, I'm sold. I don't know, man, but it does have. Let me see. Yep. Dude, that is just like my Thrustmaster T150, dude. Yep. It's just like my fucking Lex. I mean, come on now. Obviously, it's not for racing. If you're climbing a hill, I like that about it. If you're climbing a hill and you need to. Uh, Turn it off. Yeah, go ahead. You need a downshift or something. That's going to be pretty nice. So, I don't know. Other than that, it's just kind of cool. Kind of nice to have it. So. All right, while Brando is taking those off, we'll go inside the shop real quick. We'll look at all the stuff there. We're getting ready to load up. Can I go for it? Yeah, go for it, man. Tear the shit out, man. I need it out in five minutes. OK, 
Okay, so first thing that's coming out is this. Oh, and then... got to come up a little bit, dude. There's, what's that? If there's bolts all the way down. Okay, so pull it up. Do whatever you got to do. Tear, tear it to pieces. That shit's got to come out. So we are, we are going to Reno today to drop off all of Sky High's shit. Did you guys want to see the engine? Since this is a walk around, I might as well uh, reach over there and pull, the, pull that thing so we can... Did you already pull it? Oh, no. Let's pop the hood. I thought you heard me. That's why you came out here. But you didn't. I know. I said the same thing. It's in there somewhere, man. Uh, okay. Let's go. Right down, like, down here somewhere. I popped the hood yesterday, man. It's in there somewhere. There you go. All right, let's see. You want to pop it for me? Because I got this camera. Oh, yeah, the the fucking turbo v6 diesel but aren't all fucking diesels pretty much turbo these days so i guess it's not nothing special dude that's over there it looks like it's hey man i've never had a benz before so i don't know about the, where they're i don't even know where the battery is in this thing where is the bat does anybody know chime in if you know about these vehicles if you know where the battery is at Dude, where does it go? Oh, there you go, there you go, there you go. That's it. That was dangerous, man. It's okay. Okay, so what we got here is a, uh, yeah, it looks like an engine. <laughs> I don't know. What I, I mean, I'm only, yeah, where is the battery? He said, does it have a kung fu grip? Yes, it does. He said it's under the driver, uh, Gerardo says it's under the driver's seat. Uh, I didn't ask you what my Apple Watch is. Why is it telling me? Bitch, huh? See it in there? Uh, wrong. Nope, it's there's not. A of, there's a bunch of shit in there for sure. Uh, maybe it is in there. Uh, it doesn't look like a battery. Maybe. Okay, is it under the? I could, I could be wrong though. Okay, so we don't see it. Huh? No he said there ain't no battery. Right, we'll take that rack out. We'll find it. He said under the driver mat. So is it under the front? Oh look, dude, battery. Oh. Dude, look, he ain't lying. Okay, man. Know, sorry, hey, homie. Hey, shout out to uh, Rent, Rent Audio Miami. Hey, Rent, is that a business? Hey, everybody, go to Rent Audio Miami, Miami, Florida. Or is there a Miami, Texas? Yeah, hit up those dudes, man. They know what they're talking about. The shit ain't under the seat. It's under the fucking mat. See, we got the battery thing right here under the mat. Yep. Oh, we got second skin in the house. Let me let me tell you guys something. I was gonna get to that. This thing is gonna get loaded with second skin. I'm gonna probably um, probably gonna bedline the bottom for durability. But as far as sound deadening, the sides, the top, everything in this thing is gonna get lined with second skin. Um, I guess we'll do damp pro and we'll spray. We'll do everything that we're supposed to do to make it the best it can be. And. Uh, Make this thing silent driving on the street. I want this thing to be so dead silent. It's ridiculous. Right now, it's not. It's like a tin can. It's not super tin can because it's brand new, but you can hear little things rattling back there. I heard these things suck and people... This dude... Hey, this guy says, I heard these things suck and people trade them in for a year or two. You couldn't be more wrong. First of all, you, these are hard to find. And they're, they're not that easy to find used either, unless you're talking about like an Amazon truck because... People love these things. These things are reliable. They don't suck. You suck. You suck for just, hey, this, I heard they suck. That's fine. That's for him. Okay. Well, all right. I apologize. I'm in a good mood today. You can't bring me down. Anyhow, Brando, you're the voice of reasoning today. But when we hang up, you're going to be like, fuck that guy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just him because he doesn't have one. Yeah, he's just mad. He's mad because he's not hurt. I can't, I'm not allowed to, hey, everybody here tells me to settle down, champ. Hey, I'll tell you what, though, man. It's easy to tell somebody to settle down when you don't have people talking shit to you on your page. So once you get, once your page gets big enough to where people are talking random shit for no reason, then you start getting a taste of it. Then you're like, fuck you. So everybody's guilty. The reason why you are, the reason why you may not feel the same way I do and other people do is because you don't have it like that yet as far as people looking at you yet you pull your post your shit up it's not just somebody doesn't like what you're doing it's just like you got to be a dick about it though like I don't care if you don't like what I'm doing no need to be a, a dick 
So anyways, yeah, the voice of reason, the voice of reason, besides, most of the, most of the time they ain't going to say it to your face. They're just going to say it online. But other than that, the van part couldn't be wrong. I ain't mad at that, but you're wrong about that, dude. These things, uh, they're good. You getting close yet? This thing ready to take out here yet? Let's go look at the packages that's heading out to Sky High. <laughs> Hell yeah. Did you guys want to see the new laser? Ah. Fucker feels good. So all this shit's getting ready to get loaded up and go to Sky High today. Look at all of it. Yep, it does. Byron, it does have tie down points. So if you're just now logging in and you're wondering why there's no Sprinter van in the video after it says Sprinter van in the title, that's because we were just out there. But I'll be heading out there in a second. I'm just showing you guys while he's taking that out um, what we're loading it up with today. So, baby, baby, hey, come here, baby. Shot dogs. But we're live, so we can do random shit if we want. So we got all those. So then of course if you've been following my other stuff now hey for some reason my laser videos and cnc videos when i post up that i'm getting a new shop uh equipment i get really excited about it but man those videos do so shitty on youtube i can get a hundred thousand views on some dumb shit but the minute i post a badass laser man i don't get no views so hey i'm sorry if uh if i post a video once in a while you guys don't like but these are my lasers right over here we're live. So, well, here's the ones that I've already got. One, two, and then now here's three and four right here. My electrician came. It's all wired up. I'm waiting for um, waiting for Laguna to come out. 1,500-watt fiber laser. We're cutting metal. That's another CO2. So we got room. So if you watch the video, I talked about this a little bit. This is a $140,000 fiber laser capable of cutting three eighths with perfection and a little bit thicker with less than perfection, but three eighths inch steel, aluminum, all kinds of shit. I got it for a hundred grand. It's, their, it's the floor model. It's Laguna's floor model that they, they use for their demos and for the trade shows, I think. So yeah, it hasn't been in some shop getting worked too hard. So 100 Gs, save me some good money on it. It should be fired up in a couple days when they come out and train me. So it looks like it's got a small cavern we're gonna head out back out there to the Mercedes here in a second. I'm just walking around the shop real quick, but you can open up this door and bring much bigger sheets in. So it's got a 50 by 34 or something like that working area, but you can put a bigger sheet in there. So all this stuff needs to be hooked up yet. All the wires are around, it's, it's plugged in, it's ready to go. It's just, we gotta run the, um, the lines for the water hold on a second here and i gotta run these bad boys right here so oops the door isn't shut all the way all right i hear them out there pulling the thing apart right now we're heading back out hey you guys recognize this one there's the tahoe chilling if you don't know the batteries on the Tahoe are dead. They died when I was in Vegas. The charger got knocked off and they died. So 
I can jump start it and move it if I need to, but it's not primo uh, driving right now. I'm waiting for those Titan batteries from XS Power to come out so I can take all this shit out, redo it. I did this stuff so long ago that with the technology that's out now, with the equipment I have, I can do a much better job. Of course, you know what I mean? I did all this in my backyard. So let's head out here and see if he's got this yet. So yeah, there she is. She's dusty, but she's still there. Always ready to roll when the batteries are fresh. Anyways, it starts right up with a jump start, even though it's got dead ass batteries. Hey, look at the refresh rate on that. This fan is turning full speed, you guys. That's wild. All right, so how are we doing, Brando? Are we getting close yet? Uh-oh, where'd he go? I don't even hear him. He's probably looking for me. There's Alex over there chilling. He, she gets dirty too, man. Not enough time in the day to drive them all. What? Do those got to come out? Those bolts. That Are they holding that part on? Just the one? Was it? Did, should be 10 millimeter, right? Huh? 10 millimeter? What the fuck, dude? What do you have? Dude, you, that's th that is 10 millimeter all the way, dude. Dude, let me see what you got. How many wrenches do you have in your hand? You didn't even bring a 10 millimeter over. Brando, what? go get a 10 millimeter. Oh, Lord have mercy. Where's the, I need, I need the real live face palm guy. That's my favorite emoji. Brando, I can look at that and I can tell it's a 10, but watch it be something else. No, it should be like an 11 or something fucking weird because I don't know nothing about Mercedes's. Okay, so this thing looks like it's ready to... Oh, yeah. Hurry up, Brando. Hurry. I want it out of here. I actually want to get on the road. So, I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I feel like I should drive to Reno, drop this shit off. I, when I feel like when I get there, I should just buy something from Sky High and give it to one of you guys. So maybe if you're watching me right now, if you're still hanging out with me, I'm, I'm going to tell you right now, put your notifications on. I'll find a way to give something away. Maybe a couple of things when I get there. So if I go live, maybe I'll go live during too, but I won't be able to give nothing away while I'm driving, but I'll go live maybe for about five minutes. And once, once I start heading over the mountain, don't pull it out of there yet. Once I start heading over the mountain, I'll let you guys know how I feel about it. Cause we're, Hey, for, for me to get to Reno from Sacramento, we got to climb the Sierra Nevadas. We got to go over the mountain. So I'm going to know how powerful and strong this thing actually is as soon as I do it. So, uh, yeah, I'll check back in with you on that. We do that. Oh, Bola's in the motherfucking house. We got Bola in the house. Damn, dude, look. You working that hard? Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. No, no hearts. I don't know how to do that with... with uh, YouTube. Nope. Go ahead. Do you need help with that? You want me to call KK? Yeah, I'm gonna need help. All right, let me go get KK. Hold on, you guys. And this gate's open. You left the gate open. You got dogs in here, man. KK. Come on. Come out here and help Brando. Where's Sunshine at? Is Sunshine in there? Sunshine in here. Hold on, you guys. We gotta find the other dog since Brenda left the gate open. There she is. Sunshine, sweetheart. Come here, sweetie. Oh, she's a good girl. Yes, yeah, she's a good one. Good girl. That that gate isn't open, is it? Okay, we're good. Alright, you guys. God, it's so hot in this office. It's almost time, you guys. Actually, it's not almost time, it is time. But I just got it yesterday, so. KK, is he out here? Hold on. Oh, shit. We got Kong in the house. What's up, Kong? 
my new war pony. We're taking that shit out of there though. That thing, it's in my way. I can't get my gangster lean and leave my seat back with that thing in the way. Sure you can scratch up my white paint. Baby, good, good boy. You guys remember baby, right? Um, put it up on the, put it up on the thing in there. Don't put it on the pallet. Uh, put it on the side by the van. Dude, is that a pullout or? That's a cassette player, huh? Yeah. Dude, this thing is fucking badass. It's a 350 SL. Is this a rare car? Yeah. No? Is that the stock cassette player? It did come stock with that. Oh, look. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know what? Did somebody get you for your hood ornament? They started doing it, doing that because everybody started stealing them, putting them on their chains. Uh, he, You heard that there was a new Mercedes in town, huh? Yeah. All right, you know, we should uh, get the guys out here and start loading this up. Let's load up all that shit. Uh, who wants to, like, start it up and drive it over there? Get it back up to the door. Let's load it up. What stuff? Oh, yeah. We can start bringing stuff out. You want to get the dolly or whatever? Oh, here you go. Okay, so we got an SMD hat here. Hold on a second. I got to sign this hat. Did you make this one? Oh, this is one of our last ones that we uh, paid for. Oh, you did can I used to have to pay to get these made. Now we make them in-house because I got the badass embroidery machine. So any color, we got, how many colors do we have, Anthony? 15. So what, 15 colors of strings. But uh, how many colors of a uh, hat do we have? Oh, um, like four. Four? Like gray, so far. black, red, blue? Yeah. Yep. I've been selling these since like five or something like that. It, Maybe, maybe longer. I don't know. Someone bought that. No charge. No charge. That was free. On the house, you guys. Hey, my, my autograph shit comes free with, uh, with a bottle of acetone, so we can clean it off if you want to. Oh, my what? My trim panel? All right, so. Why don't you roll it forward and then put all that stuff together when it's over here so they can start loading up. You guys want to start bringing that stuff over? I'll bring that couple back to fix it. Oh, I've seen that. I mean, it's, it, it's not bad. I mean, it's. Yeah, it did look good. I mean, take it back and fix it. Did, you, did you come up with a good way to do it? To get some new, um, new stuff. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Take that one Kong's my guy right there, man. He said, dude, so no bump in the van. I've only had it like 12 hours. So, what's up, man? Um, well, right now I'm live on YouTube, but uh, yeah, so no problem. It's no problem. Uh, I don't know. Are you here? Are you here most days? Come back by and we'll, we'll talk. I'll let you know. I'll show you. It's kind of fun. Kind of fun stuff. Oh, okay. Hey. Hey, you haven't, you don't know? Oh, what, what is it? uh, look up, uh, well, hold on a second here. Do you want to be on YouTube? Hey, what are you doing? Hi. YouTube.com slash me916. 
M M E A D E nine one six. Yeah, we're live right now. Yeah, what's your name? Huh? Giovanni? What's up, Giovanni? What's your name? Shara? Oh, Shara? Nice. That's a pretty name. That's very pretty. All right. Yeah, Mead 916. M E A D E 916. So, yeah, you kind of see what's going on if you look at the channel. But, like, if you want to come, you want to come by uh, whenever uh, we're doing other stuff. Uh, Mead. M E A D E 916. Got it? 916 Tylo, just escalate. Uh, M E, if you, yeah, M E A D E. Yeah, that one. Click it. Yeah, it's gonna be that one. Sound style bass. Okay, wonderful. Yep. Okay. Yep. We'll, we'll check it out. Okay. Thank you. See you guys later. Have a good one. That's the people from the gym next door. We got Racino's next door. Hey! We're gonna pull this forward and start loading it up. Are you done? Are you done? Are you? Can we pull it forward and start loading it up? He's over there giving a second skin demonstration while I'm waiting for. I got you. I know, but we're all over here waiting for the brand. Yeah. Not <laughs> Brando. Oh hell no! Hey Valentino Santiago. No, they're not, man. Everybody, why is there always one guy on YouTube? Dude, everybody I've spoken to that owns these, that has fleets of these, say that it's like no maintenance. Like, I'm, only, I'm gonna have to change the oil next year. And that's if I drive it a lot. There's like, a, okay, maybe I'm wrong, I don't know. But I've been told by a lot, of, I know a lot of people that own these. And nothing but like 10 out of 10 ratings. So I, I got no problem. Plus it's like, I got five years. I, I don't know what I paid, but I paid, uh, just like I don't know, it's like twelve more dollars a month on my fucking payment, which isn't nothing. I gave him such. Waiting on him to pull forward so we can. What, dude, I'm done. Call okay, all right. Yeah, well, Anthony wants to know what we're waiting on. Hey, I gave a huge down payment, so I don't owe that much on this at all. But see, the I'm gonna school you guys on a little something. Even if you're one of those guys that's like, if you don't have cash, you shouldn't buy it. Well, no, that's not true, because I could have bought this thing. But if you buy it with as much money as you can, and then make your payments. You get credit and it's always good to have good credit even if you don't want to use it i mean even if you don't believe in all that stuff you can be a non-believer with your 400 credit like what be a non-believer with 800 credit that's yeah, businessman to businessman you can be a non-believer in all that credit shit and buy shit with cash with your 800 credit rating that's what i would do if i was you so you buy something let it ride for six months, make the fucking payment, and then you start hitting it with triple the payments. And then before you know it, it's done in two years. This is going to be done in probably a year because of the down payment that I give him. Oh, now we got the Cali lean. There you go. Is that what you were looking for? Oh, yeah. Let me, let me tell you guys one more thing about this fucking Mercedes. Zero percent financing. Zero. Yep. Zero. That's another thing, man. Yeah, so... Head over to your Mercedes dealer and tell them you want that 0% that you saw Steve tell you all about. Oh, do those, they, they, those seats? You weren't even listening. Look at the passenger seat. Watch I saw this. that, but. Watch this, dude. I know, but no, didn't no. you have that? Didn't, were you pumping that thing up earlier? Pump it up again. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Fun. Take a nap in this thing, dude. Does that go all the I'm going to take a nap in it. All right. Well, can we just quit playing with the seat and pull it forward so we can load it? Everybody's waiting on you. Hey. Even though I just... Dude, look at the fucking gangster lean. Yo, now... Yeah. Hey, go, go compare this one with my car. Uh, it had the same shit, didn't it? Yeah. It had this roller thing. Same exact one from way back. They don't change, 72. huh? 72. That's a, 72. That's a 72? Yeah. Man, I was just a baby. I was one years old when that thing was brand new. That thing looks like it's in a magazine next to a fucking camel cigarette ad. Where's the key? The Marlboro ad is next to here. I don't know. Oh, here. Shut all the doors and I'll back this thing up. Are uh, you going to back up to the doors? Yeah. Okay, hold on. Please shut the doors. All right. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I will. I'll shut them all. All right, so we're going to load this up. I'm going to show you guys. Show you guys what it looks like. And then I'll go live when we're on the road. I'll let you know how it feels. Hey, does it feel better without that damn rack there? Way more spacious. Yeah. Yeah, look at all this room, man. Hey, second skin. 
don't run no other brand but second skin you guys get the real deal i'm not just i mean i'm just saying man i believe in stuff that's why i tell you are you out of here yeah all right calm all right sounds good thanks man cool 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 look at the dually we're dually hey i was sold when i saw that you guys it doesn't have a tow package yet so i'm gonna do the tow package because it'll tow like a son of a bitch now so i gotta put that on there and then of course like i said if you missed the early video i'm going to uh do the windows all the way around and then of course i want to put some seats in it too removable seats that way i can carry some people and i can take them out and carry some bullshit if i need to it's gonna be fun Yeah, he does. He's got a backup camera. Oh, yeah, hold on. Let me show you guys the backup camera. Hold on, Brando. I'm going to show him the... Let's see that backup camera. I know, hey, I'm all excited over the little shit, even though every vehicle I have has backup cameras. This one's got it in the mirror, though, so it's kind of cool. Close enough, right? Yeah. Uh, shout out to Second Skin. Everybody's talking about Second Skin. That's, You know what I'm talking about. Exactly. So I think the very next person to go to secondskin.com and buy a pack needs to um, tell them you saw this video and get a free second skin sticker. I think it comes with stickers though. So I guess that isn't so cool. But yeah, don't buy it for the free shit. Don't buy it for the stickers. Buy it because it's the best product. You know what I mean? They do give out a lot of free stuff, but at the end of the day, don't worry about the gimmicks. Worry about how well the product performs and second skin's the best. If it wasn't, I wouldn't be using it. Look at the war pony already getting put to use, you guys. This is why I bought the Sprinter van. I have to put all this shit in here. I can imagine KK's Yukon. Hey, put all this shit in your Yukon and meet me in Reno. Sprinter van, getting to work. Hey, for real, appreciate you guys coming in checking out my live feed. I know that uh, my last video with the lasers got really not that many views. It kind of sucks, I hate that. But whatever, man, I'm gonna put up videos of my life and the things that I do and some shit will do 100,000, some will do a million, some will do 19,000. But go back and look at my last video, man. I need some more views, man, that's weak. What? What? Baby, do it for baby, you guys. Do it for baby, huh? That's a rough bud. A good dog, huh? All right, you guys. We are getting ready to load up. Do me a favor, hit like, leave a comment in the comment section if you want me to go live when I get to Gately's, because that's here in a little bit. But I don't know if he's even going to be there or not, so maybe that ain't going to work. I'll call him up. If he's there, I'll pull up on him. If he ain't, I got to go. We're heading to Reno. So, all right, you guys, walk around one more time. Just because this is a Sprinter van, this thing is not even budging. And I know that shit is heavy. Oh, before I hang up, one more thing. I'm trying to downsize this shop. I got to make room for all this shit that I have. And uh, I really do. I always talk about how I want to give more stuff away. It's just hard to do it because being fair and not getting cheated on and everything else is tough. But I have all this stuff, man. I think I've shown it already once before. Kicker sent me so much stuff and I don't know why. I do love the brand and I love everybody that works there, but I don't have any affiliation with them. They're not partners, they're not sponsors or anything. But they sent me all these boxes months ago. I think one of them has some swag in it. I didn't open the other ones because I didn't know, 
I have no idea why they even sent it. So I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. So I'm going to probably have a big live opening. I'm going to open all this shit up live on YouTube in the middle of my floor. Cause I look at the space it's taking in my alleyway here. We're going to open it up. We're going to open this shit up. We're going to start handing it, handing it away to you guys and put it this way. They're not partners. They're not affiliated with me at all. I do love the guys. I love the product. I always have, but it's going to cost me money to ship all this stuff to you guys, which I have no problem doing. But just so you know, it's not like any kind of publicity stunt for kicker. It might be on their end. I don't know, but it's here. It's in my way. And, uh, I feel like I should give it to you guys. I don't, I, I only know what's in like one of the boxes, the rest of them. I have no idea. So it's going to be a big mystery box, unopening or uh, unboxing fucking whatever's in there, man. It's going, it might be an app in one of those. One of them feels heavy. So set your notifications to my channel, Mead 916. You're on it right now, obviously. And, um, you know, you know, I love you guys. All the guys, all you people that are cool, all my supporters, much love. We're all loaded up. Go live from the road. I'll see you guys soon. Check back. I'm going to Sky High. If I remember, and I think I will, I'm going to give something away. When I get to Sky, I'm going to buy something at Sky High with my own money and give it to one of you guys. I have no idea what, but I'm going to. So be ready. All right? I'm out of here. Love you guys. Peace.